Hi, this is Morgana Ray, the Charmed Life Coach and Money Magnet Queen with another Money Magnet Tip. And this time we're going to go in a slightly different direction and I'm going to teach you how to repel money. I've got five different ways and today's way to repel money is to let people owe you money. We all want to be nice people, we all want to help people, but if you don't get paid back, what is the message that you are sending to money? I know that when I've done that, it's like I've been saying to my sweet money honey who wants to stay with me, I'm saying, oh, that's okay, the money doesn't matter, the money doesn't matter, and what happens to a relationship when you tell your partner that he doesn't matter? Well, in my kind of relationship, the money went away. And there's another thing going on, is that when you loan people money and they owe you money and they aren't paying you back, and you don't say anything because you want them to like you, they don't like you. I mean, seriously, what happens, and I've seen this with clients over and over again, is that when they think of you, they feel guilty. And they start to associate those feelings with you. And then they think of you and they don't feel good. They feel bad and they start to resent feeling bad. And what I've seen happen a lot of times is they start to rationalize why they shouldn't pay you back because then they feel less bad about themselves. And you can just imagine what happens to that kind of friendship. So letting people owe you money is not good for your relationship with your friends. It's not good for your relationship with money. And it's really not good for your relationship with yourself. And if you want to be attractive and be a money magnet, you have to be a good relationship partner because you're going to have a relationship with money for the rest of your life. So you better make it a good one.